Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to go about getting the Sea Scholar title in Archage Unchained. But before I do that, I would like to ask that if you aren't currently subscribed, if you could go ahead and hit that subscribe button, I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much. Also, I'll be posting my Archage affiliate link in the description below. Also recently, I have created a Patreon page if you would like to support me this way. The link will also be down in the description as well. All right, so first up, before we start this quest, if you haven't done your UBA quest, I would recommend you do that and get that skill. It'll be in the top right. The UBA skill helped me a lot with getting this achievement. So first you'll need to travel out to Dehuda's garden and find the Drown Sailor Jack and the coordinates are down here in the description box as well. For Drown Sailor Jack he will drop Rose's Letter which is the quest starter item to getting your title. And you can read this if you'd like, it was kind of sweet. So from killing mobs, you will get two different kinds of keys. You'll get the Moonlight Key and Sunlight Key, and you'll need to find this chest. It will have three quest starter items, and if you don't get Heart of the Sun initially, just check back later as you can turn both of these quests in at the same time. As you can see here, the chest also gave me the Tristy portrait which is a side mini quest and gives you some exploration proficiency for it and you can turn this in over in sand deep as well so the main quest starters you'll be looking for is heart of the sun and rose's letter which will give you the quest a letter from the depths once you have both of these you can portal over to the sand deep community center and find lady rose along the ocean edge the quest will auto-populate and you can read the entire quest line to kind of understand how both of these characters got to where they are. Alright, so at this point, after you've turned both of those quests in, I would recommend that you get at least five rows of open space in your inventory. For this achievement, to get the title, you will need to collect every page from her diary, which is 40 pages in total, so four rows, and then the four choirs in order to bind the book together. Any of the pages can drop from the Seawise Drowned Victims, and once you have all 40 pages, as well as the four choirs that bind the pages into manuscripts, you'll just need to right-click on the choirs in order to bind them. Once you have all four books in your inventory, you'll need to return to Lady Rose in Sand Deep. She'll then express her shock that you obtained all of the pages from her diary and she asks that you keep her secret. And you can see once you turn it in, you will get the title Sea Scholar as well as the manuscript to bind into a book that you can then place in your house and read. So once you have the manuscript, it will take some paper, memory ink, and leather. You can go to a print press and bind the book. Now that it's in your inventory, you can take the book to your home. You can see also that by binding this book, we got an achievement for it. And you can now place the book in your house. 
and read this story. And let me tell you, I read this story and ooh, it was juicy. Eh, eh, eh. All right, so if you'd like to see what was in her diary, be sure to hit the subscribe button as I will be posting that video soon. So thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time.